We are continuing our coverage from ITSEC 2010 here in Orlando. We're in the STEM Pavilion and here with two of the student exhibitors. And if uh, you would, tell me your name. Tell me where you're from. Uh, my name is Chris, and I'm from Dayton, Ohio. All right. And you're Janetta. Janetta, you from Dayton as well? Absolutely. All right. What school? DECA, Dayton Early College Academy. All right. That's awesome. Well, so what was kind of the inspiration uh, behind the project? Well, last year we started a first robotics team, and the game was called Breakaway. It's basically soccer with an obstacle course thrown in. This is actually the layout for the field. All right, so Jeanette, if you can tell us a little bit about the robot, and you, were, you began to talk about the game, so talk about that a little bit. Um, well, basically the game is a soccer game, and what the obstacle course is, is you have these speed bumps, essentially, that are like 18 inches high, 45 degree angle, so they're really difficult to get over. And then you have these tunnels that are about 26 inches wide, um, and so it's kind of hard to get through, especially if you have a large robot. You have these hanging structures, or these poles, rather, that you can hang off of in the competition at the last 30 seconds to get extra points. So if you want to, I can actually show you how yeah, our great. robot works and kicks. Yeah, that's great. So down here we have our kicker, and basically how it works is that it's a human kick. This pushes over a lever, and the surgical tube and stretches, it builds up elastic tension. The pneumatic pistons pull this lever back, and as we release the air from the pistons, it pushes it over. So that's basically how it works. In the competition, it was our rookie year, and so, you know, it was a lot of complications with actually being in the competition, but we went to regionals, we did well, we won the rookie award, and we were able to go to nationals and compete. Oh, that's awesome. Another great example here in the STEM Pavilion uh, at ITSEC 2010 of some great student work, and we're so excited and proud of you guys for, uh, uh, for being here. So maybe one day we'll see you back uh, working in one of the big booths. How's that sound? Absolutely. Thank you so much. You bet. Continue our coverage from ITSEC 2010. More to come from the STEM Pavilion coming up.